I think it's, uh, you know, confidence, a little bit of, I don't know if it's just a freedom, but I feel like we feel look a little bit looser, the ball's moving fast. Um, you know, on the attacking side, that is, uh, you know, I think we are, our priorities to try to get the ball forward and, and to be dangerous and be more aggressive at home are, are leading us into in a positive way. You know, I think we've talked over the last three, four weeks just about uh, being better at um, uh, taking moments to put teams away. Uh, and whether that be get the first goal, uh, then add the second, add the third, things like that where, you know, in the past we feel like maybe we've let some moments, some, some opportunities slip where we, went, we didn't put games away or we didn't, you know, as they say, step on the other team's throat when we had the chance. So, uh, and that's something we've been talking about a lot and it's remaining aggressive and, and being proactive, especially at home and, uh, you know, trying to get the first, second, and third goal. And, you know, I think the guys have, have done a good job responding at that and, and made plays along the way. What does it say about this team that regardless of the personnel that's slotted into the starting 11, you guys always manage to find results and find ways to win? Yeah, we have a good group. We have a, you know, a deep group. Everybody's uh, bought in. Everybody's working hard. Uh, we've got a lot of guys who have a lot of ability. Um, you know, and when we slide certain guys into certain roles, it's not always the same look. It's a little bit different. You know, each guy brings his own special uh, qualities to the team, and you know, but everybody is understands that they're needed at all times, and uh, and everybody's playing a part. So I think you know we don't have anyone sulking. We've got a bunch of guys who are ready to compete at a given uh, in a minute's notice, and um, you know that's just building. Uh, everybody in the locker room is you know I think feels like they're an active part of what's going on, and um, you know that confidence is important in the group. We just slide one guy in, and uh, he keeps it going. Is it fair to say that this team is no longer flying under the radar and still 11 games remaining on the season? You guys could potentially have a target on your back given that everyone knows what to expect from TFC from this point out. Yeah, I think so. I mean, I, I think for us, it's we continue to focus on getting better every day. I still think um, you know there's things that we need to progress at and get better at and the details we need to be more precise with. And so we focus that in terms of targets. I. I always feel like we're a club or an organization that, that has a target anyway, just because the types of players that you know we've brought in over the last couple of years, between obviously Seba and, and Josie and Michael and so you know all the guys really that we brought in, and now the you know just in the last um, really this year defensively we've proven a lot of things, and now over the last several games we're attacking wise showing that things are clicking again and that we uh, you know we're a force on that side and, and we knew it was coming and it's good to see and now it's about keeping those things going and tightening up on details so that we can become a better team as we approach the end here.